This video brought to you by the Bose Headset 10. And by WX Weather. White Knight 2, the huge double-hulled aircraft that will carry Spaceship 2 and its cargo of space tourists up to 50,000 feet, rolled out to the public for the first time Monday morning, July 28, 2008, scaled composites in Mojave, California. The ship, which has been under construction in secrecy for three years, has a wingspan of 140 feet and is the largest carbon fiber aircraft ever built. This airplane will go to Virgin Galactic, which is building a spaceport in New Mexico. The aircraft's two cabins are identical and each can hold up to eight passengers. However, only the right side is pressurized and equipped for flying. The other side can be used to haul cargo and can be modified also to carry passengers. On a typical flight, the ship may carry future space tourists for training purposes and fly parabolas on its way down, giving them a simulated zero-g experience. At 50,000 feet, White Knight will drop Spaceship 2 with eight on board and the spaceship pilot would light the rocket, point the nose toward the stratosphere, climb into suborbital space, and experience weightlessness, along with an extraordinary view of our planet. White Knight is capable of climbing much higher than 50,000 feet, and future copies will likely be built for commercial uses, such as launching satellites or carrying bulky cargo. It is also capable of launching a ship with one astronaut on board into orbit. The ship is expected to begin flight testing by the end of this year, and by next July, we expect there will be one on site at Oshkosh where it may take its first flight before the public. Project financier Richard Branson and designer Bert Rutan spoke publicly at the unveiling. It's quite something, isn't it? Um, I just wanted to say welcome and uh, thank you all for coming today. Um, and thanks to all the team at Virgin Galactic. Um, this is an enormous moment for us, and I think you will all agree that White Knight 2, or Eve, as we will be able to officially call her very soon, is one of the most beautiful and extraordinary aviation vehicles ever developed. And I... <laughs> Rutan spoke more specifically on the aircraft's utility. The beauty about this configuration is we can, with this airplane, uh, go out and launch uh, a light satellite orbital boosters that are flyback reusable boosters. We have Branson later suggested to reporters he's looking amongst his Virgin Atlantic airline pilots for potential astronaut trainees and is interested in developing a second spaceport somewhere on the East Coast. With details to follow. Stay tuned.